Last week here at Snapdragon Summit 2025, Qualcomm took the wraps off the X2 Elite Extreme, a brand new Windows on ARM processor from the company. This is now the top end processor for Windows on ARM machines that Qualcomm makes and probably the best across the entire industry. It's the fastest, most powerful, and most battery efficient chip by Qualcomm's claims. But now I've actually gotten to see some benchmarks run on reference devices that Qualcomm provided to us. And of course, the benchmarks look incredibly good. Now, these are reference devices that Qualcomm created specifically for running these benchmarks. So don't expect your benchmarks to be as high on a machine you buy from a retail partner, whether that be Dell or Microsoft or Acer or whoever. But this does show that the Windows on ARM processor is probably going to be more powerful than pretty much any x86 processor. Of course, what Qualcomm isn't talking about is how many programs and video games still don't work on Windows on ARM. To Qualcomm's credit, it has made a ton of progress in this area since last year, while partnering with Microsoft to make all the programs that you use every day work well on Windows on ARM. But there are still a ton of video games that won't even launch on Windows on ARM, which makes them a hard sell for hardcore gamers. So. What you have to decide here is Qualcomm's claims of just how powerful this chip is going to be enough to sway you away from x86. That was the question last year, and it's the same question again this year. What do you think? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below.